Spring football camp report from the Dalk Indoor Sports Center. I'm Steve Baker along with freshman Doug Costin, Westchester PA native. We we're just talking a little bit outside Philly. Uh, what, what what got you to Miami University, Doug? Um, definitely the feeling like that I was home. When I came here, I instantly felt like back I was on my hometown. Had that really nice feeling having uptown Oxford right here. Definitely made me feel like I was a part of the group and everyone it was just family. You had a chance to, to get some action and now in the spring ball. Uh, talk. I want to talk a little bit about the work in the weight room. Obviously, in the new APC, you guys have a new weight training facility. Uh, obviously, getting stronger and faster for every member of this team is key. Right. I'm um, definitely moving into the new facility. I feel like it helped us a lot. The weight's in there. Everything's just brand new. Everyone's Everyone want to get in there as soon as possible and just start lifting. And definitely kids like AJ and Akeem, they push each other in the weight room. They come push me. I definitely see them as like leaders, too, and they definitely have helped me along the way, even in the weight room. You know, and, and that's the one area that, you know, when you go back a few years ago that needed a lot of work. What was it like for you coming in from high school, obviously, to college? Was it a big difference in what you were doing weight training-wise? Uh, absolutely. I mean, I feel at my high school, I felt we were prepared. But definitely coming here, there's definitely you got to get used from going to high school to college. And they definitely, like the people I mentioned earlier, they definitely helped me settle in. Mm -hmm. Now, the D-line is one of those areas where there's a lot of competition in there this year. Obviously, you lose some, some key components right. in JT and Austin. How's that been going so far in the spring? We're definitely losing people like JT and AG. They're definitely people you got to replace, but the battling up front has been incredible. Offense and defense pushing each other. Definitely feel like the offense making the defense better, D-line making the line better, and everyone just want to compete and get out there. Yeah, and there, there's great competition between the O-line and the D-line out here. Even in spring ball, if you're coming out watching practice, you guys are really getting after each other. Right, it's a lot of fun because I know every day I come to battle and I know that they're going to give me their 100% as well. Mm -hmm. What is it uh, that this D-line and yourself has to do over the course of the next couple of weeks here in spring to get ready for that summer and fall? Uh, definitely just keep, keep competing, getting in shape. I know it was one thing, we're look, trying to define ourselves, so definitely try and find that edge, like what is the D-line this year? Because with those leaving, we had a motto last year, and now we got to find our own motto because it's a brand new set of guys. Doug, thanks a lot, man. For Thank you. you. Doug Costin joining us. And again, two weeks from today, it is the Spring Showcase here in uh, at Jaeger Stadium, just outside the Dalk Indoor Sports Center. Everything gets underway at 7 o'clock on that Saturday morning with the uh, equipment surplus sale going on on the West Concourse. Also, the one-stop shop will open up your chance to buy season tickets, parking passes, join Swoops Club. If you have little ones, uh, you can all do that all right there in the one-stop shop. That'll open up at 9 o'clock. Then at 1 o'clock, the Red Hawks take the field at Jaeger Stadium, and you'll have your chance to come out and see the 2017 Red Hawks. Make sure you plan to join us two weeks from today, April 22nd, for the Spring Showcase.